It's the Anything Goes Podcast, man. It's your boy, Sean Peoples. Hey, people, if you like the vibes, you like our movement, man, like, subscribe, share, man. Comment in the comment section. Hit the notification bell so you can keep up with everything that we got going on, man. Jump in our community tab and vote. Vote, 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 vote. Hey, also, man, like and share this. Share this with your friends. Share this with your family, yo. Share this with your uh, your cohorts, all your people that are out the road. Share, 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 share. Share it with everybody. This is the official uh, review of Alkaline's album. Top price. Yeah. First off, I'm going to say, I some vloggers and what you call them, um, YouTube personnel out there beefing and warring over if Alkaline albums is good or not. Um, everyone is entitled to their opinion, of course. But remember, the goal is to build reggae music, not to fight and destroy it. So when you on the internet, you know, destroying a next man character because he has a different opinion of how an album or music sound, you yourself sound like an idiot. So I just wanted to put that out there. So if you feel like my opinion about music is different from yours and you take it to a sense of feeling like you want to bash me and talk all type of crazy things about a person, then you're an idiot. But yeah, officially, I am an Alkaline fan. I'm not the biggest Alkaline fan in the world, of course, but I am an Alkaline fan. Overall, I'm a reggae Dancehall music, Jamaican fan. I'm a fan of my culture. So, when I heard Alkaline album, you know, I thought it was a good album. You know, I didn't think it was a bad album at all. I thought it was a... I thought... I, I knew what Alkaline was trying to do, to be honest with you. I feel like he was trying to to uh, give a mixture of a, a variety of different type of music. He even have a, a, a reggae reggae type of music, reggae song music in on the album. So I think he was trying to give you know, some bad man, some girl tune, and then throw a reggae in there for sure, diversity and different type of, of angles so people who like the music could hear different aspects of Alkaline's um, uh, 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 portfolio when it comes to music. I feel like comparing his first album to this album... I mean, usually people don't create their best work after they create their best work. Because if, if Alkaline first album was a classic, even with rappers, it's hard to recreate that classic. And everybody knows that. So if you don't feel like the first al this album match up to the first album, then, you know, I mean, it's to your personal belief your personal interest, what your ears hear and what your mind think. So I can't really tell a person, so you can't think that. But at the same time, all I have to say is that, you know, sometimes it's hard to redo a classic. A classic is a classic. And sometimes when you make a, a, a great body of work, it's hard for you to conquer that great body of work. So people usually feel like, Anything else you do is not as good as it. And they may even try to compare it to that to that body of work and demeanor the new body of work compared to the to, to the first body of work. But you know, that's that's how that's people mindset, that's how people roll. But you know, I like the girl tunes them on the album. I like the youngster tunes them on the album. You know, Alkaline always do some good youngster tune. And I I, I feel like, you know. To, to a person out there might not, you know, they might not understand what Alkaline was trying to do. Because, you, know, you know, I'm in music, so I, 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 I listen to music differently from how most people listen to it. And I feel like Alkaline was trying to do, do something different. He was trying to show different ranges of, of, his, um, of his ability to, to create music. And to some people, they might feel like, he didn't execute it properly. So they might feel like, no, I'm going to like the album. Yeah, I'm going to like this. But overall, I think the album was good. I think that, you know, I can vibe with the album. You know, if if it wasn't for copyright um, things on YouTube right now, I would I would play the album in the background so you can hear 
some of the songs off of the album. But yeah, I listened to the album. You know, I I I, I listened to the album more than once. Because I'm not a person who listen to an album one time and then say, yo, I like it. You know? It's like uh, I have to listen to the album three different times before I decide to say, I talk about it. And I, I think the album was good. I think that uh I think he could have put some I mean, features would have definitely did did good for the album, but you know, you know, Alkaline I'm on. You know, everybody already know Alkaline role already. Alkaline do him one thing. Alkaline no uh, really have nobody tell him off oh, run for him thing. And, you know, Alkaline I'm on big man. And all this comparison to what the album sell, we should all be going out there buying the album. I purchased the album. We should all be buying the album whether you're a vendetta fan or not. You should buy the album because overall it's, you're supporting reggae music, you're supporting the culture, you're supporting Jamaica. Because no matter if Alkaline live a foreign or a Jamaica, you know, he's still a foreign a family of Jamaica. So some of that money is going back to Jamaica at some time or another for go back in our economy. So we should be supporting that, that you know. When I think about, you know, the, the range of of people comparing um, Alkaline to Vibes Cartel doesn't make any sense to me at, at this point when it comes to the album. You know, everybody have their own taste and everything all of them. But when it comes to the album, Vibes Cartel is, is synonymous to being the king of the dance hall and longevity and coming with different style and different things. But I feel like Alkaline is, is building his, profol- his portfolio towards that. And I don't think that, I don't think that that um, this album demeanors that. I think that sometimes when people listen to an album, they don't get it right away. They don't get it. It have to grow up on them. And I think everybody wanted to be the first to come out and do something about the album. So they listen to a couple of songs and they run, come out and say, "Me not like it or them as a fun already, so I love it. But you have to listen to the album a few times. Not, in a, not even I see him dear too. Because technically, I listen to the album more than three times. So I listen to the album. The album will depend on repeat for the, for, the first, um, for the first day. The album depend on repeat. But I don't count that as, you know, more than one listen. I count that the next day you now after, you know, I made the album. I play it again. And you say, yeah, you know. Played a couple of times that day the two while I play around the house while me I walk around and I, and I go about my business and them thing there. And then uh the next day, which was uh today, earlier today I played it some more and then I even it to a time where I, I, I put it up to the loudspeaker and make it beat for about an hour. Just make it beat and just hear how it feel, you know. I haven't put it in the car yet and drive it in the car. That's the only thing I'm going to do it because I haven't really been going anywhere. Because, you know, I'm a day and now I have really nothing to do in you know, them time. So I just beat it in the house and it sound good to me. You know, like I said, you know, I, I, it, I'm not going to say it's the greatest album ever, greatest album ever created and greatest album ever this and greatest album ever that. You know, that's, that's not for me to say. But for me to say that I like the album or I like the music on the album, that's what I'm gonna tell you. I enjoyed I enjoyed the album to the fullest. And you know, I'm I'm one of those people that come here and I'll be honest with you, if I didn't like the album, I'd be like, yo, you know, say the album was shot at this and the album was shot at that. You know? Like I said, the only thing the only thing I could say, some features would I probably do well. But Alkaline I'm one man, Alkaline do him feel like do it for music. That's all that's what his creative notion at the time was probably say, you're just me alone. Cause you know when you, when he's an artist and you have a create you have a, a time when you create. He, he, he probably created and have some ideas I say, yo, the brother would have fit in good pan a song, yeah. Or the brother would have fit in good pan a song, yeah. But you know, so I'm not really uh, no, I'm just I do that when I by myself. And then next time around I might throw in this brother or that brother. So, you know, I think he have all the rights to do what he want to do with this album. Because after all, it's called Alkaline Album. And he put it out to us as fans. And there's nothing wrong with disagreeing that you don't like the album, you know. It's the, the bickering and all this stuff, obviously. And I do, I, I do understand that these things sell, you know. 
and, and get your views. And uh, at the end of the day, that's what people are doing it for to get views. But, you know, I like the album. Uh, everybody around me that listened to the album like the album. My son even said he liked the album. Couple songs off of the album. Yeah, my son, run it back. You know? Yeah, that you there. Anyway, it's a different story. Yeah, but, yeah, man. I think it was a good album. I think Alkaline did good. Support dancehall and reggae music. Support our culture. Don't be on the internet fighting out our culture because you don't prefer an artist. Remember, the goal is Jamaica and the culture of Jamaica at the end of the day. So when you did their ping it and kill it to somebody else, then the people them who's expecting you to guide them towards liking the music start say you say, it's a idiot tune or... This are the best thing, and them not think are the best thing. So you have to keep in mind what you do when you do it. That's all I'm saying. No, nothing more than that. Keep in mind what you do when you say it and when you do it. You don't know it go already, man. You know, Alkaline, your yeah, album, thumbs up. I'm going to listen to it again when I'm done listening to this. So maybe we'll come and do a, a official song for song review when I when, when listen to it a few more times so I can tell you, say, Yo, you yes, see number five, uh, data, you know? So, yeah, man. But overall, Alkaline, big up yourself. Reggae music in general, big up yourself. This is a, a good thing for our music and our culture. And for everybody out there who fighting against them one another about our culture, let's bring that together and be better than that, man. I don't know. I don't think goes podcast, man. It's your boy, Sean Peoples, man. Um, People. You like my vibes, you like the movement, anything goes podcast movement, like, subscribe, and share, man. And then don't forget to up on the road to 5K, where I give out some cash to some of our loyal subscribers when we reach 5K. So all our people out there who have been supporting us thus far and, and been supporting us from the first day till now, big up on yourself, maximum respect. You know how anything goes podcast, man. We out of here, man. I'm gone.